Hey guys, GP here. Now I'm going to be going for something a little different for this video. As you guys saw by the title, there's some changes coming to the channel starting this month. For both channels, of course. So that being said, whichever channel you're watching, I'm going to leave the links to each one in the description below for you to check out. Which, If you're interested in my second channel or my gaming channel and you're not watching them. But now, this is going to be a bit of a news video. Also, don't mind the different camera angle than usual. I've got a new stand, so that makes it easier for me to keep this stuff up uh, my phone so it doesn't keep falling over. But from that aside, this is going to be a bit of a different video in the sense of how it's going to be kind of like a news video in a way. So I'm going to be covering a lot of different things here. New stuff coming to the channel. Um, some stuff that you might not be seeing as often and then live streaming I might cover as well. So let's start with what's new to the channel. This is where it's actually really exciting. I finally got Subnautica and that's going up on the channel next week. Um, so stay tuned Friday and it's it's gonna be a treat hopefully all goes well. Um, as for the other new things I've gotten that I hope to try out soon, I've gotten, if you guys remember, Dark Deception that didn't work out too well, so I got Dark Deception Monsters and Mortals, the multiplayer version. Again, don't think it'll work well on my computer, but I'll give it a few test runs before I play it to make sure. But that's another game to be anticipated. Of course, primarily multiplayer, but still, it should be fun for everyone to enjoy. Um, next up, I've got Phasmophobia, which I've been waiting for a long time to get. If you guys aren't aware, I love um, ghost hunting. I've always been a believer of the paranormal, um, in case you guys weren't aware. And I'm hoping that this game will kind of get me a bit in the field a little better, kind of in the know. Of course, I know all the entities in the game are all strictly just malicious, malevolent. But still, it's, I'm excited to play it. Um, this is as close I'm going to be as a ghost hunter for quite a while. That being said, it's a multiplayer game, so I'm hoping that alongside with Phasmophobia, Don't Starve Together will also be on the list soon. Um, I've been talking to a buddy of mine you might have heard of before, Rexious. Uh, this guy, please follow him on Twitch and on his YouTube channel that I will leave under uh, in the description as well. But hopefully, we've been talking, potentially... And we might be able to get some Phasmophobia and Don't Starve Together videos done together. We'll see if what else comes out of that. Now, as for the stuff that's going to be not as prominent as on my channel starting this month. Um, Crush Crush. That's definitely taken a lot of time to get some stuff done there, accomplished. And as much as I love playing the game for you guys, it's kind of dulled down, I suppose. Not many people have gotten much more interested in it. But do expect to see... Um, all throughout the month of February, for certain, and when new characters come out. Turbo Dismount, I think I'm also going to drop, too, because it's fun, but at the same time, it's kind of staled out its welcome, I suppose. I mean, I enjoy it, it's hilarious, and you guys love it, too, but do expect to see less Turbo Dismount on the channel as well. Also, another new thing I should bring up, which you guys have probably seen for quite a while now, Plants vs. Zombies 2. I've beaten the first one, I'm moving on to the second one, and I'm having a blast. Be uh, prepared to see a lot of this game in the future, because it's definitely going to take longer to complete than the first one. There's a lot more to it, so hopefully you guys are going to enjoy it. Um, what else? Oh, yes, right. For the next, uh, the next few weeks, uh, you guys are going to be seeing kind of like a schedule basically, for my videos. And when I mean schedule, I mean there's not going to be as much, like, content here and there, I suppose. So, of course, I'm still trying to complete games like Little Nightmares. I'm trying to complete that before Little Nightmares 2 drops, which hopefully, um, don't know when I can get that, but it definitely looks much more creepy than the first. So, that's going to be a trip for me for certain. Um, Don't Starve, FNAF AR, I also plan on keep running for a while. Don't Starve until, I'd say, March? Uh, then I'll take a break from it, because I've always seen it as, like, the fall and winter game to play. It's pretty good. Um, but yeah, for the foreseeable future, you're going to be seeing a lot of, basically, a strict schedule. Because I've got Plans vs. Zombies 2, um, Bioshock, Subnautica, Smash, and Mario Kart Tour as games are going to be basically there for the entirety of the next few weeks. Um, of course, I am trying to mix it up, though, with uh, Little Nightmares and FNAF AR, all that type of stuff. 
So hopefully you guys are going to be excited for that. It's going to be a change, but I want to get as far in as Subnautic as I can. I want to beat Little Nightmares soon before Little Nightmares 2 drops. Don't know how much more I'll be able to go into Bioshock. I mean, I'm, I think I've reached, I've made it past the halfway point. So that's probably still going to be going for a while too, which I don't have a problem. I'm excited. Also, I hope to do Bioshock 2 and Infinite in the future as well, if you guys are interested, that is. Um, what else is there to mention? Let me think about this. Oh yeah, my second channel. So, Season 2 of Universal Yums is done. It ended with the Egypt box. I should have probably put Season Finale. But Season 3 will be starting um, next weekend with my buddy Mass Freak. We're going to be opening the final box we got uh, for last year, which was the... Holiday pox from around the world, snacks from a bunch of different ones, just like the very first video we did uh, for the Universal Yum series. And we've got at least six months worth of box, so yeah, there's gonna be that's gonna be quite fluent. Season three of Universal Yums, mystery skulls. Don't expect too much of that. Aside from having passed like over six thousand six hundred views at this point, you guys are insane that you guys are still watching that. Um, of course we know it won't be out until, like, the year after this one, so probably not too much Mystery Skulls content, my apologies. I am keeping, uh, track with Has Been Hotel, though, because the first video, uh, my reaction video to the first episode did good. I know Hell of a Boss has been around, but I'm kind of watching that myself. It's Has Been Hotel that's usually bigger, but Hell of a Boss is also pretty cool, too. Um, I don't think I'll be reacting to it, though. Also, don't expect anything Monster Jam related. I know it's been a while since I've done something with Monster Jam on this channel. On my second channel, at least. Uh, but as of the case of it is in the world right now, still kind of not good for any of this. So, yeah, no go on Monster Jam. But, yeah, also the Sunday Smashdowns are going to be more creative as well. I'm going to, hopefully you guys can see this. Give me comments for some matches you want to see. Um, in specific, you want to see us use different characters. Um, I know we've got a few set out, but we're kind of running out of ideas and we need your help. Um, no new news on Security Breach or Dark Revival yet, still taking their time. But I do know Security Breach comes out this, uh, this year, so very excited. And as you can tell from my last Minecraft video as well that went up today... Um, definitely still in the works on that, but hopefully I'll get back to it soon as possible. I'd say I'm at a pretty, uh, pretty solid point so far. I just need a little bit more time and work on it. And for last, we've got live streams. Expect a lot of Baldi's Basics Plus coming out of the live streams. And then something new, um, coming tomorrow, Tattletale! Um, I was watching back my Tattletale playthrough, and I only did two episodes, and I, like, didn't b finish. I didn't complete it. Um, I got near to the very end, but I didn't complete it. So I'm going to be doing, basically, I think I'm going to add this live stream to my Revisited series, which I did for um, a few of my games. Except I'm going to be re redoing the entirety of Tattletale on stream. Hopefully I can beat it. Hopefully we're going to have some fun. I know it's not Christmas, but it's as close as I can get. And yeah, as for other live streams, I'm still thinking of ideas. Once there's more news on Security Breach, the Five Nights at Freddy's live stream is going to be happening, where I'm going to be going through all the games, Road to Security Breach, and when Bendy in the Dark Revival, when we have more news on that, I'm going to be streaming Bendy in the Ink Machine, as well as maybe Boris in the Dark Survival. But, yeah, that's a lot to unpackage. I know this is usually a longer update video than my usual thing, but a lot of news. A lot of excitement going around, for certain. And, um, I hope you guys are looking forward to it. So, that being said, um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please be sure to do so if you're watching this video from outside of the channel, please, we welcome you in. And also, for those of you who are watching from my channels, please be sure to share this video with your friends. Spread the word of all the content that's going to be coming to my channel. I'm excited to make it for everybody. Um, we've both, last year was a big milestone for me. We passed the 100 subscriber mark for both my channels, which is awesome. Let's keep that going. Let's keep it rolling. I don't expect us to hit a thousand or even 500 anytime soon, but let's keep the subscriber count going. You guys are awesome. Um, keep showing my videos to the world. Make them know that I am here and I am here to entertain for everybody. Although hopefully I might also start live streaming with the case of donations 
we'll have to see. I don't know. But I think that's all I have to cover. Again, thank, if you made it to the end here, thanks for sticking with me and for supporting me. And yeah, not much else to say. Check out my channels in the description below. Check out Rex's, Rexius's Twitch and channel in the description below as well. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay gold, my friends, and bye-bye!